families are justifiably concerned. Julie Zuckerman takes her job of caring for Washington Heights families seriously. She's the principal of the Castle Bridge Elementary School. Last Thursday, two Customs and Border Protections pickup trucks parked right in front of the school, immediately sparking fears of an immigration raid. This seemed like a pretty bold statement um, by those agents. One truck was on the sidewalk, steps away from school doors. Parents were on their way to pick up children. ICE and um, Customs and Border Protection will randomly stop people, ask for ID, uh, whether there's cause or not. And that's just not something that should be happening in a school. So Principal Zuckerman went looking for the Customs and Border Patrol agents. Well, she got out of that building. She went into the local taqueria. She told those people, get over there and move your vehicle. You are sending my community into a tizzy. And they did. I wanted the trucks gone. While the agents were just in the area for lunch, today Mayor Bill de Blasio reassured this community. Uh, it was raised to the officers or supervisors, and they have affirmed that they will not do that again. Omar Fraya is a father here. He was angry after spotting the trucks. It was a blatant act of intimidation. It was not by accident. This morning, Congressman Adriano Espaillat stood in the same spot where the Border Patrol vehicles were parked. He said immigrants, regardless of their status, should not have to worry about taking their child to school. The school is a, a, a nourishing center for teaching, and, and, and community gathering, not for law enforcement to come in, kick down the door, and arrest people and take them away. We did reach out to Customs and Border Protection today for a statement on what happened. They did not get back to us, but they are going to hear tomorrow from the parents and the kids when they hold a rally here after school. Reporting live from Washington Heights in Manhattan, Ayanna Harry, X11 News.